I was with my sister, her husband, and their two-year-old daughter. We were talking about loved ones that had recently passed. Th- passed. My father had died sometime recently. My brother-in-law went and grabbed a picture of his mother who had died in a car crash when he was six to show me. When my niece saw the picture, though, she started laughing. We asked her what was so funny and she looked at us and said, that's my special friend who sings to me. I still have a shiver just thinking about it yeah so would I I mean if my niece I don't have one but if my niece walked up and said that to me that I mean what what's up guys and welcome back to another video today we are going to be looking at scary things kids have said let's move on to the next one go back to sleep there isn't anything under your bed he is behind you now. Still haven't gotten over that one and shiver at the memory. I mean, yeah, totally. I would be frightened too. Next one. Walking past an old old cemetery, my bit. Walking, hold on. Walking past an old cemetery. Hold on, let's see if I can hide that a little more. I'm sorry, I can't hide that that counter, so you're going to have to deal with that. My then three-year-old son casually said, my brother is in there. When I reminded him that he didn't have a brother, he said, no, mama, from before when the other lady was my mommy. What? That's kind of creepy. I mean, that is kind of scary. What? I was talking my two-year-old. He said, goodbye, Dad. I said, no, we say goodnight. He said, I know, but this time it's goodbye. Had to check on him a few times, make sure he was, he was still here. That's really creepy. What's up with all these... These scary things wow jeff the and the the person who commented was named jeff the killer and he said creepy kids lol my sister got hit by a drunk driver in april and it totaled her car she had my four-year-old nephew and my infant niece with her when my mom arrived at the hospital my nephew asked her if he would think the big guy what big guys, Caden? Grammy, the big guys that were in the car with me when it got loud and scary and they hugged me with their arms and kept me safe. Even the insurance adjuster cannot explain how either child escaped with not a scratch. Whoa. D- wait, who, but who are the big guys? Who are the big guys? When my cousin was two years older, so her mom got pregnant again. One day, she went to hug her mom's belly and said, Little brother sick. A few days later, she had a miscarriage. What? How in the world did that happen? How did that happen? I mean, come on. I mean... When my son was small, I was talking to him about growing potatoes. I described how you bank up the earth around them as they grow. And he said, I used to do that when I was an old... What? I'm sorry I keep saying, like, what? But, um... (coughs) But, I mean, come on. I had a slushy earlier, so that's why my teeth are blue. To be honest, I should have, um... Brushed them before I got on here. I'm gonna go do that. But an old man? Really? I mean, 
Come on. Um, yeah, I mean, this is ridiculous. No way. Getting my two and a half year old daughter out of the bath one night, my wife and I were briefly thinking on her how important it was to keep her um parts clean. She casually replied, Oh nobody What screw messes with they tried one night, they kicked the door in and I tried to Oh, nobody strips me there. They tried one night, they kicked the door in, and I and tried, but I fought back. I died, and now I'm here. She said this like it was... N Wait, your two-and-a-half-year-old said they died. Said they got molested, and then they died. Um, that... You might need to go see a doctor for that one. Why are you crying? Bad man. What bad man? There. Points behind me to a dark corner of the room. Lamp on bookshelf next to said darkened corner falls off as soon as I turn to look. She slept in our bed that night. Yeah, probably I would too. My three-year-old daughter stood next to her newborn brother and looked at him for a while, then turned and looked at me and said, Daddy, it's a monster. We should bury it. What? These kids doing creepy stuff. My mother was babysitting my daughter while I was at a doctor's appointment and said, Oh no, Grandma. Mama's not coming in anymore today. She was in a bad, bad accident. She can't come... I had indeed been in an accident that almost killed me at that exact time. None of my none of my family had yet been notified. Oh dear. Yep. My sister Haley. My sister Haley was not that Haley. Ha my sister Haley was born exactly two months after her great-grandmother died. One day, Haley woke up and said, informed us it was her 95th birthday. When we tried to reason with her, she started crying, saying her real name was Irene, my granny's name, not Haley. This lasted all day, and the next day she didn't remember anything. What? How did you... How did you not remember anything? I was sound asleep in at I was sound asleep in around 6 a.m. I was woken by my four-year-old daughter. His face inches from mine. She looked right into my eyes and whispered, I want to peel all the your skin off. But here, but it, the backstory here is I had been sunburned the previous week and was starting to peel. In my sleep addled state, however, it was pretty terrifying for a few seconds. It, I didn't know if I was dreaming or what was going on. Yeah, I wouldn't have known what was going on either. My four-year-old son and I were waiting for our food at Panera. While we stood there, he started rubbing his belly my belly and talking to it. I asked him what he was doing. He said that he was talking to the baby. I informed him that I informed him that I was not pregnant and he said there is a baby in your belly. I just saw it crawl across the floor and climb up into you. That's kind of impossible. Was it a ghost that you saw maybe? You might need to call the Ghostbusters. Last one. 
Just today, my four-year-old son told me, I think we live in a pretend world and someone is playing with us. I asked him what he meant and it got even weirder. Well, it seems like someone does things to us, but we can't see them because they, we are in this world and they are not. Woo! That is actually kind of creepy. Well, so there you have it. That's it. That's going to do it for scary things that kids have said. I don't hope you enjoyed the vi I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a like and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you all. I will see you all in the next one. Bye.